This is a question involving tr uh, two sets of ratio. So uh, we will present it this way. First we have um, x, the volume of container x to container y is in the ratio of 5 to 2. And then we have a z. Uh, the volume of container, water in container y to container z is 8 to 11. Okay, so we can see that y um, in the first ratio is 2 units and y in the second ratio is 8 units. But both y are the same amount of water. So we will equalize these two numbers, 2 and 8. To find the common multiple of 2 and 8, that would be 8. And we will convert the first one into 8 by multiplying by 4. So here also times 4. So 5 times 4, we have 20 units. 2 times 4, 8 units. So you see that now, in both ratio, y is the same number of units. And this one no change because um, it's, that is the 8 to 11 is not modified at all. So from this, they said that the total amount of water is 78 liters. So we will add up everything. 20 units plus 8 units plus even 11 units equals to 39 units. Therefore, 39 units is the total amount of water in all three containers X, Y, and Z. That would be equals to the 78 liters of water. Therefore, one unit is 78 divided by 39, which is 2 liters. Hence, um, part A, to find the amount of water poured into container X, X is 20 units. So let's find 20 units. That would be 20 times 2, 40 liters of water. This is the answer for part A. And for part B, how much wa more water was poured into X than Z? So X is 20, Z is 11. So the more than amount will be 20 units take away. Uh, 11 units. Which is equals to 9 units. Therefore, 9 units will be 1 unit is 2 9 units will be 9 times 2 18 liters more water was poured into container X as compared to container Z who has only 11 units so that's the answer for part B